many seconds does it take for a man to break this priceless clock, ignoring the rules of nearly every museum on Earth which state do not touch? About 15. Let's rewind and explain how we got to this mess. A man and woman approach a wooden clock sculpture at the National Watch and Clock Museum in Columbia, Pennsylvania. After taking a photo, the man gets a closer look at the clock and begins tugging and yanking parts of it, seemingly in an attempt to make it run. Of the 1,500 clocks on display, some of them don't constantly run, and museum staffers who've watched the video on repeat think the man was trying to get it to start. After touching the clock some more, he got it moving all right, and watched time stand still as it fell off the wall completely, smashing on the ground. He tries to hang it back on the wall, but it's no use. The museum posted the video to Instagram and used it as a teaching moment with the caption, this is why we beg visitors not to touch museum objects. Despite media reports saying the man ran off, the museum director says he actually went to get help. The museum is not pressing charges and the clock can be fixed in-house. It'll just take some time, a few months to be exact. I'm Sean Dowling for Buzz 60. Now you know, pass it on.